What is going on guys, Anatoly from Define Agile here. Hope you're doing great. This is a very short tutorial where we're gonna look at the new Jira UI. If you noticed a couple of weeks ago, Jira asked us if we would like to switch to new UI and then you could say stay with the classic one. But I think a couple of days ago, they just made a switch. So everyone who was using, um, who was using old classic UI are automatically transferred to a new UI. So it happens, a new feature, and so we just need to be okay with that. We are hoping that Jira created this UI to better serve us customers. So let's look at this UI. If you remember before, the main difference is there was a bar on a left, and this bar had top level menu, and then they had a sub menu. Now they moved the whole bar up top. So now all, everything, contextually is on top, so it gives us bigger space uh, overall here, which is pretty good. We can see more of our projects. It's actually really, really good, and it's more modern. I guess people are moving from a left side sidebars, from a sidebars to the top bars now, and this is a trend that many companies do now, so I think it's pretty good. And then a lot of uh, submenu, a lot of submenus went into this sort of pop-ups now, or should I call it drop-downs? Drop-down menu, sorry. If I click on a project, uh, we will see all the projects here, but we also can create a project right away from this, which is very good. Then we have filters. If we wanna um, do a search, advanced search, it's easy now. We can click here or we can view all the filters. We will have our dashboards, and then here we can switch between all of our dashboards or create new ones. Uh, importantly, people, this is where we can start a team or manipulate um, people in, in the system. So similar as before, we click on apps, we, would, we can see all our Jira apps. And here, as always, we can create, we we'll click on that, we'll create an issue, we can select a project, we can select a type. So we can do it right through here without even going into a project. And then, uh, usual search, so we can search as we did before. There is a bigger space here now to search, which is pretty cool. All our notifications are here. Jira help is here, settings and uh, profile and account. So not no major changes here in terms of uh, functionality, but just different way how the UI is structured. We also, if we want to access Confluence or other things, we can switch to it and uh, or administration we can go and do it here so this ui will be available everywhere you go now so if we go to our project for example we see that ui is still here so we can do all of this at a glance again but we also have a sidebar as we previously did so we usually had this uh, blue line blue menu on the left now this blue menu on the left moved up and some things were, were added to it to get easy access to certain things. So I think that's it. If you want to go back, you can Jira software menu. Really not too much have changed, but I think it's a good improvement. It allows us to easily navigate and I hope this helps. If you have any questions, put them in the comments down below. If you want to learn Jira very quickly, I have a course now that will allow you to learn Jira in one day, step by step, really intense. You can go to products.defineagile.com slash Jira dash course. I'll put the link below as well. And then you can learn all this in a module. I will walk you through everything and uh, you can learn that way as well. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you and I'll see you next video. Bye bye.